Hello friends, today we are going to see how to segregate zeros and ones in an array. So let's see an example. So this is the array and in this array zeros and ones are placed at different positions. So now you have to convert this array into this resulting array. So this should be the result. All the zeros should be segregated and ones should be segregated at the other part of the array. Now let's see how to do this. So the steps are written here. First you have to count the number of zeros in the original array. So this is the original array. C. So you have to count the number of zeros. So for counting the number of zeros you have to initialize a variable that is c and t is equal to 0 for example and then you have to start from index 0 so I will give indexes here 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so uh, if a of i is equal to equal to 0 then you have to increment this counter so let's see so a of i is equal to 0 yes so increment the counter so it will become 1 now i will be incremented here so again see whether element at ith position is 0 yes so increment the counter again increment i so element at ith position is 1 no so you should not increment the counter you just increment i again it is 0 so increment the counter and increment i it is 1 so not incrementing the counter only increment i again it is 1 so not incrementing the counter you have to only increment i yes this is 0 so increment the counter and increment i as well so in short you have to traverse the array and count the number of zeros. Now it is 1 so it counter will not be incremented and the array is over. Okay. So we have counted the number of zeros in this array. So again in the same array you just have to go on assigning 0 to first 4 positions means because the counter is 4. If the counter is 5 then first 5 positions. If it is 6 then first 6 positions. So any number of zeros whatever is the counter in the original array of zeros. So now first 4 positions are filled with 0 and all the remaining positions should be filled with 1. So this is how we segregate zeros and 1s in an array. Hey friends, please subscribe to my channel as I post algorithm videos every day. And if you want a video on any particular topic, then please mention in the comment below. Thank you.